welcome to my channel so today what we are going to make is a very nice craft for little kids you can do it with your even like 10 to 12 year old kids and they can make it themselves you know that we tell our kids all the time the importance of sadqa or zikat during the month of ramadan so i thought in order to make kids get involved in this in this whole idea let's create a sadaka jar for kids or they can do it for themselves so i have created a sample very simple that's how it looks it has little coins in it that kids can put for themselves and then at the end of the month they can just give it to someone whoever deserves it or needs it the most so it's a very simple project let's see uh, which uh, materials we are going to need it's very simple let's start it together so what i have used a simple construction paper and i just drew a little jar on it and then i just had cut it in the same shape so it's like just give it a jar shape and just cut a simple construction paper you can choose your own color whatever you like then i have used a lamination sheet this is a plain lamination sheet that I have cut and I have used the same shape, same size so that they will be going on one another like this. And then we are going to hot glue them. So let's do it together and then at the end I am going to use some, you know, little ribbons. You can use anything, um, you know, decorative to give it the size to make it look more pretty and then I'm going to use this gold sharpie marker to put to uh, write sadaka on it and just to give it a little shape of uh, the jar so let's start all I need is a hot glue gun and I'm just going to use hot glue gun to make the sides go all uh, so that it has has all the hot glue and then I'm going to place this plastic sheet on it. So let's do it together. So I'm going to use it all over on the sides so that the whole area can have the glue and it just gets stuck really nicely if you have very small kids do not let them use hot glue gun you can tell them they can cut the paper in the shape but do not because it's very hot so it's not uh, it can give them a burn but if you have older kids it's okay for them to use it So now I have put the hot glue all around the corners. Now I'm going to put the, this sheet on it. So I'm going to make sure the corners are meeting together. And it does not mess up. If it gets a little bit out of the shape, you can always use scissors to cut it a little bit extra that is around the edges. So this is how it's going to come out. So we put hot glue all around it and then I have glued the uh, transparent lamination sheet on top of it to give it like a little back kind of feel. Now to make it look more pretty, I am going to use these decorative things on the sides so that it can cover our glue pot and it also looks pretty. So let's 
start doing that. I'm going to glue this on this side. Then I'm going to cut any extra that is left with the scissors along the corners to keep the shape. There you go. So it looks like this. Then I'm going to use another to do this side. this here you have to be careful while using the hot glue gun make sure that your fingers don't get burned I'm going to do the bottom part. And any part that is left, then we are going to use to cover any uncovered parts. to do the last part that we did not cover this one. Almost done. So Alright guys, so this is how it's gonna look and now we are going to use the marker to make some jar design on it so that it has a look of a jar. So I'm going to show you. Let's see how we can do it. To give it the... Um, 
the opening of a jar so we will give it round lines and then I'm going to write sadaka on it Look at that, that's how it looks, it says Sadaka. So now what we are going to do, it's all done. Your kids can hang it with the wall or they can just put it, uh, pin it up and they can just use some uh, like a plate holder or a tray holder kind of thing and just put it in there. And I will put some coins in it so that you know how it works. So let's put some coins in our jar. I think it's a really cute activity to do with your kids. To give them the spirit of, you know, uh, collecting some money for the pe people who we want to help or who really need our support. So look at this. Oh, you need to put a little hot glue here too. All right. So This is how it looks. So this is our sadaka jar and you can also make it at home. If you uh, put the coins and you feel like one or two coins fall out, you just need to put a little more glue, hot glue at the bottom to keep them in. So this is how I have created my two sadaka jars and you can always make them at home very easy. All you need is a plain construction paper, a plain lamination sheet hot glue gun and then one marker to write on it so i hope you like the idea and you keep supporting my channel